Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this morning we have a piece of uh, 416 stainless steel. Uh, we're going to put it on the uh, Unimat uh, SL1000 and we're going to take some cuts on it. Uh, I have reverted back to my 8 degree tool for this one um, just as another experiment. Uh, I, I ran the 8 degree tool on the tool steel and uh, some 304 uh, as well as running the 10 degree tool on them. Uh, the 10 degree tool <clears throat> is very nice for a lot of things. Uh, the 8 degree tool, which uh, is a 16 degree included angle, takes a little bit more horsepower to run, but uh, for tougher materials um, it often keeps an edge a little bit longer and all that good stuff. Um, if you care, take a ride with me. Taking a real shallow cut here just to clear off anything on the outside of it before I dig in. Okay, uh, this time we're running uh, 850 RPMs by the chart. And uh, that 8 degree tool doesn't seem to be having much trouble with it. Uh, you hear a slight dip in the RPMs. Uh, 416 is not the harshest thing you could ever uh, machine, but for a Unimat, I'm sure um, it is earning its breakfast this morning. Now this is a little bit deeper cut here. You can hear the uh, motor drag down just a little bit. Um, that is the disadvantage to the 8 degree tool. Um, it takes a little bit uh, more of your power to make uh, the cut. But, your edge will survive, even on tough materials, uh, within reason, I, I suppose. Um, I don't think you'd necessarily want to run it up against uh, titanium, necessarily, in the 8 degree. Uh, maybe it would cut. I don't know. Maybe that should be a video for the next time. See if I can get a hold of some titanium and try and cut it with this uh, 18 or 16 degree Included angle. Now, this is a full hog here, so I'm just laying it to it. Keeping a continuous chip going here. It's a little chattery at the end where I come up against the last cut, so I usually stop just a bit short there. Uh, why not? Let's take a big cut. In case you didn't hear it before, this is 416 stainless steel. But, there you can add another material that can be turned on a Unimat. Thanks for watching.